Jump back into the coach's corner. New Perry head coach Kevin Smith talking Panther football with our Bill Shanks. I was born from the bottom, but raised to the top. I was born from the bottom, but raised to the top. I was born from the bottom, but raised to the top. I'm going to keep on climbing. Kevin Smith is back, the head coach at Perry. All right, let's talk about the team this year now. You've got five starters back on offense, five on defense. As far as five starters back for who was there last year, they haven't started for you yet. That's right. First, your offense. You, you've got a couple of quarterbacks going to be playing for you, right? Yes, sir. We've got a, a, a junior quarterback, Christian Corbett who is uh, making great strides uh, right now. He's uh, first year in our new system. We're going to the spread offense. Mm -hmm. And then we have a ninth grader coming in, Lane Rucker, who has really been pushing Christian. Um, you know, they've probably been getting an equal amount of reps right now at practice. Um, so we're looking forward to, uh, for that battle to continue for somebody to step up and say, hey, I'm the man. It looks like you've got some skilled players, including a pretty good group of running backs, too. Absolutely. Uh, Terrell Owens is a, be a sophomore uh, running back. I think he started at free safety for the previous uh, coaching staff. Uh, we're looking forward to him. Uh, he's a big old back. And he's got good speed, good hands. Uh, he's an all-around athlete. Uh, we feel like that he you know, is going to make us go on offense. Uh, with uh, his running ability and his catching the ball out of the backfield ability. All right, defense, you got five starters back as well. A couple linemen, uh, Dontarius McGee uh, on the end there for you. How do you feel about your D? Uh, well, D, we, we're putting it together. We're learning a new scheme on that side of the ball, too. Mm -hmm. And uh, Dontavious is one of those guys that he has one gear, and that's 110 mile an hour. And he goes, at, whether it's wrong or right, he's all over the field. So he, you know, anytime um, uh, being an old line coach, the game is one in the trenches, so mm -hmm. you got to have guys up there on the front, front end that can change the line of scrimmage to give you a chance to win. All right, um, you know how football is. It doesn't matter that you're a first-year head coach. Expectations are going to be there. Are, are you realistic about this season? Do you feel good about what you've inherited here to take this team to the next level? I mean, they were three and seven last year, so obviously everybody's looking for that winning season. Mm -hmm. How do you feel right now? We're still in August, but how yeah. do you feel right now? I feel great about this guy, uh, this team, and uh, one of the reasons why when we came in in January, all the way up until this point, those guys have been there. They've been there all summer, mm -hmm. uh, and we've been really hard we've been pushing the bar up on them every week and we get harder and harder and they keep coming back keep coming back we're starting to find some breaking points now mm -hmm. and they still coming back so I'm excited about this bunch uh, you know we're not gonna set a we're not gonna set a win-loss thing yeah I, I expect us to go into every game and compete and win. And if we come up a little bit short, we're, gonna, we're not going to start pointing fingers. Mm -hmm. We're going to go back to work on Monday, watch the video, and we're going to go out there and get it correct and go out there and win the next week. Well, that stability is something Perry's looked for, and that helps a lot as well. First game will be on the 25th uh, against Rutland. Coach Smith, thank you so much. Good luck to you. We appreciate you coming in. Yes, sir. Thank you. And you can see that full conversation in all of Bill's interviews with Middle Georgia's football coaches at 41NBC.com. Larry Harold, Central's new coach, is in the corner tomorrow. Well, it is a series that dates back to 1964. Every year since then, the Northside Eagles and Warner Robins Demons have met on the football field. The inner city rivalry, which has drawn crowds of more than 15,000 fans, starts our high school football season, and it is this Friday, our game of the week on the end zone. The Eagles have won 10 of the last 12 meetings in the series, including a 55-3 whipping last season. We here at 41 NBC will have live reports from the game on Friday during the early evening newscast. And then the end zone with Bill Shanks. Highlights from all over Middle Georgia starts around 11:15. Our full game lineup coming at you later this week.